Hi, this is Wu from National Indoor RV Center, and in this video I'll be going over how to program your local air channels on your TV or programming your park cable on your TV. So, first thing you want to do is power up your TV, and then press the source button on your remote and make sure you're on the TV source. So right now I'm pressing the source button, you can see it's switching between Blu-ray Blu and TV. So, I want to make sure it is on the TV source. Next thing you want to do is head over to your wine guard control. Now this is an Integra coach and you'll find this mounted above the entry door in the cabinet and it is that wine guard control right there. Right now it's turned on and the on and off buttons right there. If you press the search button what it'll do is it'll spin around until it finds the strongest signal and locks into the strongest signal which is right there. Now these two other buttons are for fine tuning so you could slightly move them in case the channel's not coming in properly. You could try spinning it a little bit and seeing if it uh, locks into that signal a little better. Alright so once we know that that's on you want to come back to the TV and on your remote you're going to find the settings button right here and I'm going to go ahead and press setting and then I'm going to use these little arrows right here to move around and choose what I want and to select what I want you press the little button in the middle so on the screen you can see that I'm on picture so I'm going to press the arrow for the down button until it goes down to broadcasting and then I'm going to press the middle button and select it Right, right here you can see it says auto program I'm gonna go ahead and press the enter button and it's gonna ask me if I want to start the auto program All right once I get to this screen you can see where it says um, what kind of channel scan you want to do air or cable so for this example we're gonna choose air I'm gonna press select and it's gonna start searching and scanning uh, for any available air channels All right, so now that you see the scan is complete and we found 30 channels, what I'm going to go ahead and do is hit the select button on the remote under close, and I'm going to press the exit button on the remote, and you can see that I'm now getting local air channels. All right, I'm just going up and down on the remote, changing channels. Alright, so for part cable, what we have to do is make sure that this wine guard control is turned off. So when this wine guard control is turned on, it's letting the air signal pass through it or boosting that signal. When you turn it off, it will allow for the part cable signal to come through. So you're going to go and press the off button twice, and then you'll see that the light has gone off and then if you also look at the TV now there's no signal now the park cable hookup is outside by your shore cable reel there's a, a little port there with a coax hookup for hooking up park cable when you get to a campground and right now at this location I don't have a park cable hookup but I'm just going to show you the operation of what you would do. So it's going to be the same as just as the air channels. You're going to hit the settings button. You got to make sure you're on that TV source. And again, I'm going to hit the arrows down until I get to broadcasting. I'm going to press select by pushing the middle button here. And then on the auto program, same thing. I'm going to push the middle button. Okay. Go ahead and press the middle button again to start it and then I'm going to use the arrow and move it down to cable and just like before you have to let it do a scan and then once it's done scanning whatever part cable channels are available uh, it'll start displaying on the TV